Poor Wendy, who's sitting here, she's got uh, connected to a heart monitor, which is at the moment sitting at about a, 109 beats a minute, 110. Um, <laughs> you're, this, is, this is ice. This is ice and snow, but it has extended so beyond that. Yeah. Where did it start? Um, I had a fall um, 29 years ago when I was pregnant with my oldest son. Um, I was about seven months pregnant, fell over in the snow. Um, and it's just escalated from there. To what degree? Um, any crunchy noises. Um, the sound that snow might Yeah, make. anything that relates to the noise, the snow noise. So there's certain things in your house that the, the kids can't eat. Yep. They can't have it around you. I mean, your social life, this is affected anywhere you go where somebody might have ice in a glass. Mm -hmm. you, you can't be anywhere near them. No. So it's impacted <clears throat> your life hugely. You nearly missed your wedding day. Yes. <laughs> because it's... They forecast snow. <laughs> and so you said, if there's snow on the ground, I'm not going to be there. I the phone or something. Oh, I wasn't going to go. And your family has adapted to this, haven't yeah. they? I mean, they're all very good. Like you said, anyone who's got an extreme phobia like this, people do work around it. But it's not ideal. You're missing out on an awful lot yeah. of life. Do you believe you can be helped with this? Um, I don't know. Your heart rate is now up to 120. You're shaking. <laughs> I can see your fingers shaking. When I was speaking <coughs> to Wendy earlier, and she, she told me that she's had a lot of therapy mm. uh, already. So, again, if you have a lot of therapy and it's not successful, it also creates another schema that this might not work. And so a schema, schema, schema A schema is a cognitive thought process or a belief or a reference. Look at your heart rate. I know. Maybe your heart rate is going up a little bit because you know what we're, you know, we're, we're obviously going to talk about this a little bit more. Yeah. Uh, now, we don't surprise you with things. I, we, we will just, we've got to know how bad this is for you. We'll stop at any stage. And so we're not doing this for, for uh, effect to make you cry or anything like that. If you're uncomfortable, we stop straight away. Now then, I've oh, got oh, behind really 131, high. and I don't know at what, what's the safe point for us to stop. 140. 140. So if you, if you touch 140, we're going to stop anyway, because it's just, that's just not safe. So, um, Behind here, we've got I've got some ice. I've got ice in a glass, and I've got an ice lolly, and I know that that's a problem as well. Can I get up and go round to that? Yeah? Let me just walk round here to do that. Remember, you don't have to do anything. No. All we're to get in here is a gauge, just so that we know that eventually, hopefully later when you come out and you suddenly can do these things, that we know we've got a level. That's all. So in my left hand, I've got a glass, and in that glass is some water and some ice. How are you feeling? <laughs> scared. Feeling scared? Is it okay for me to lift it out from behind the sofa? Yeah, just don't jangle it. <laughs> don't jangle it. Okay, there, there, is, there is the ice in the glass. 137 was the peak there that we just saw. If I was to jangle that, then that would be the worst thing. It's the noise that would do it. OK, well, okay, I'm not, yeah, not going to do that, and I won't do that. Um, what about, what about? because, you know, obviously the whole family, ice lollies and things like that. Um, ice lollies a problem? Mm -hmm. can, I, can I pick one up? Are you sure? Okay. It, 136, it peaked out there. I, um, is it OK for me to lift it up? So there, one ice lolly. What, would be, what, what, what would be the worst thing there? That ice lolly would be biting it. Biting it, of course, which okay, I we've won't gone up do. To Absolutely won't now. do. One thirty-nine, and I, I think, think that I that's, think that's, that's enough. Good, that that's demonstrates stopped. exactly how bad. Well done. This that's is. you got to think. That's the worst that's going to get now. That's done. it. Done. That's done. It. Done. And there's no, and, and there is no no way anybody watching can know how bad it is oh, uh, until they now. see until they see the reaction. So you're done. Your heart rate is now peaking at 150, 155. Slow down. Calm down. It's done. Yeah. It's done. Okay. It's All done. done. Yeah. It's done. Yeah. Okay. okay. There we go. Time. Time. Dropping okay. down a little bit. Good. Fine. You're done. It's all over because the next time you sit here, you'll be a different person. Okay. You see. And I know that you don't believe that, but you will be. And this is what they do. Okay. All right. You're right. Okay. Okay. Let's leave it there. Let's leave it there. Um. Good luck. You've clearly you. got can your you, work. Can you sort cut this out? out? This is. This looks like such the, a massive challenge. It is a massive challenge because, as we can all see, this is huge and it's escalated and it's branched out into different areas. Yes, we, we are completely confident that we can help Wendy, not a problem. The only little thing is that we have only got an hour. Yeah. Uh, we're going to do as much as we can in an hour, and obviously if we need to continue after that, then we will. Um, but, yeah, we, we, we will make a massive difference Good luck. to her. Good luck. Your heart okay. rate drop a Go and get a cup of tea. Thank you. Things are calming down now. Right.